So Tony, what do you what do you like most about your round out there today? Yeah, the putter putter felt good. You know, a lot of putts actually. You know, I hit really good. I didn't go in, but um, I was happy with the way I stroked it, and um, I was able to kind of free up. I feel like the the rest of my game. What's the difference been for you these first two days versus the other times you've come out here to play? Um, I've scored it nicely. You know, last year I played you know pretty well. I think out here the first couple of days. Um, you know, I, I put some good work in. You know, and just in our off season and even last week, not playing at the Sony, I was able to. Put some work with my coach and um, and just ap- approach the part of the game that we feel like needs work. And um, I've been able to do that and, and find some success here the first couple of days. The bunker hole out. Uh, how much of a happy <laughs> accident was that? Yeah, well, I, as soon as I hit it, I actually I said go in. You know, I, I hit a perfect bunker shot. Um, so I, you know, I think even if it doesn't go in, it's going to hit the flag and, and at least stay close. It's a really really hard shot. Um, bad error on the shot before, um, leaving myself in that position. But that's always a bonus when you can do something like that, and it ended up being huge for me. You know, I was able to birdie a couple holes coming in outside after that. How much confidence do you have throughout your game going to the weekend, playing back on the stadium course for two more rounds? Yeah, my game feels good. It's a golf course that I think fits someone that hits it far. You know, I can reach all the par fives uh, on the stadium. Uh, as we know in this game, it's going to come down to scoring and come down to putting, especially on this type of golf course. Um, I don't think you're going to hit too many uh, balls out of bounds. You might hit some in the water, but Ultimately, you know, the game comes down to who's going to make the most putts on the weekend, and, and hopefully that's going to be me. What did you feel like you had to work on the most before? Yeah, my, 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 you know, I've been, I've been working ever since September. Um, I kind of weakened my grip, and that's something that I, uh, I've always had a weak grip growing up. Went to a strong grip, and now back to going a little bit weaker, and, and sometimes you just have to get enough reps when you make a change, and that's all it was. You know, last week, just making sure I had enough shots to know what the golf ball is going to do, and it seems like so far it's, uh, it's kind of paid off. Other guys have mentioned the fact that last year was so strange and played so late in the season. Do you feel like you didn't even have an off season this year? Do you feel like you just kind of spilled over into the new year? Yeah, pretty much. You know, especially you know having qualified for Maui. There, there really I played the QBE. There really I had two weeks off, and and we went over early to Maui, so really one week of, of being at home. So really not really an off season, but um, I've kind of learned throughout my career, uh, you have to do your best to make your game sharp throughout all facets of the game throughout the whole year. Um, sometimes you're not going to have an off season. Pick and choose the tournaments and, and try and get your work in when you can. Thanks. Good. Thanks.